tilapia for a mussel food. People. We're running late. I literally just came back from the gym, did a bicep session. Ugh. And what I'm doing now is I'm about to film some challenges with my friends because they're girls. So it's gonna be like some girly type challenge, like the Bean Boozle challenge or the Whisper challenge. One of those. I haven't got time to shower, so that's just our secrets. Like you, me, and Jesus. I don't have a maid, so I gotta take out my own trash one day. And that's the camera. What kind of definition is this camera? <laughs> <laughs> Boy band out here, look mm. at that! Oh, look at the whamminess though. It's all about low rest times, we're out here. <laughs> Hopefully you can hear me clearly. I'm using this microphone that I bought a few days ago. I think I showed you in the last video. And they also speak by near the end. But basically this video now I thought I might as well do a voiceover because I haven't done one in a while. Plus a lot of people keep asking me uh, more or less how to grow their arms and stuff like that. Because I've seen in the latest videos that I am, as I've gotten leaner you can see my arms are a lot more definition. It's quite a bit bigger than it used to be. So that's good. I think I started, I think before I started bulking I think I was at 15 inches. Now they're just under 16 I think or 16 for my right arm just under 16 for my left arm. So that's around an inch, inch and a half inch growth, which is pretty good. But basically what I've been doing in this workout and what I've been doing for a good while now, it, on my arms anyway, is that I focus on a lot of the long head exercises for the arms and stuff like that. And also do a lot of drop sets as well. Basically, your arms are a massive muscle, you know what I'm saying? So you gotta try and hit them with a lot of volume, a lot of time on the tension, which is why I like do, using a lot of cable. For example, cable's really, really good because the contraction is constant because you got the cable on the negative of the exercise, more or less. You're still feeling uh, burning your arms because you're using the cables, whereas with the dumbbell, gravity sometimes lets your arm fall down if you don't control the weight downwards. So I feel like they both have their merits, which is why I like to throw both of them into my workout. Today, what we kind of done basically throughout this whole workout is drop set C. Every last set of the exercise we did, sorry, was basically a drop set, especially on the machines. I think two of the exercises, I think the very first one we did was only uh, was only like one drop set. But everywhere else, we more or less dropped the weight twice. Um, but basically, that is the gist of what I've been doing to grow my arms. A lot of volume, make sure I do a lot of long head exercises, and a lot of tricep exercises, because people always think you got to focus on your bicep to try and grow your arms. When your triceps are the biggest portion of your arms, like of your arm, two thirds of it is the tricep. So if you would like to grow bigger arms, don't think, don't neglect the triceps, and definitely don't neglect the long head triceps. So it's more or less, Making sure that you're hitting everything. People just go there and do bicep curls. You ain't gonna do. You ain't gonna get massive improvements because the biceps are not a massive part. And the people that do that also, when they're doing their biceps, they often focus on like short head bicep, which is pretty small, which is which is the peak, which gives you like the point on top of the bicep. But if you want to make your arm overall the, the massive, it seem bigger, you need to make sure you're hitting like all the short head and the long head of the triceps and the biceps. Um, so that's more or less my kind of tips to kind of increase growing your arms. Make sure you're in a lot of volume. The rest periods, try and keep them low. I found with arms especially, I need to keep the rest periods low to get a really, really good pump. Because I find that with other with other work, I say my chest, stuff like that. I can maybe have a rest period, say like under a minute and a half and I still feel good. But for my arms, usually I try and keep it 60 seconds or less because I feel really, really good. When I'm training with a partner, it's hard to achieve this. But when I'm on my own, I literally have the timer on and I do 60 second rest periods and I get back onto it. And it's been doing me really, really good the last, I'll say three weeks I've been doing these certain rest periods. But uh, before then I was doing a lot of like just volume anyway, regardless. But only recently I've added in the rest. But anyway, I want to leave you guys to the rest of the video, so thanks for watching so far, and keep watching the full video, and I'll see you in the next one. Oh, look at the doubt. The doubt looks alright for this angle, you know. 20, 15, 17, No, 12. I'm doing this as well, 20, 15. <laughs> <laughs> Right, currently got my post uh, workout apple, Royal Gala, Lidl, my G. 
Thanks for supporting the channel lately. Uh, videos have been getting like loads of a lot of likes, like getting over 100 very consistently. So all I can say is thank you because all that stuff will help the channel do better. But as I said, I'm gonna have my apple right now. Uh, I want to talk through the workout. Uh, basically, I've been doing for the last two weeks now, I'd say, is I've super upped up the uh, intensity of the workouts. Like I do way, 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 way more like uh, drop sets. Rest periods cut down. Like literally, I have a timer on my phone sometimes when I'm by myself, and literally 60 seconds, but then it strengthens the workout. And it really does, like, it, my body's still getting used to it because sometimes I have to take more rest days a week than I previously did because my body's just so sore, which is good. It's always good to, like, make. I always say this keep your body guessing. Some people are like, what? It basically means like don't let your body get used to a certain workout or routine so every like 8 to 12 weeks switch up something whether you even change if, you're, if you like the exercises you're doing even change the order of them and it will really really like impact your body because different muscles will get fatigued at different points. Today the whole point of it was I didn't show you all of our workouts like literally today was the arm session and I was in the gym 2 hours half hour for that was uh, cardio but still it was a 2 hour gym session on arms normally in arms I knock them out in an hour fair enough I was with Sean as well so that adds on probably maybe 15 20 ish minutes but it was a very intense session everything we did was a drop set so I thought let me show you at least two or three exercises we're doing and then show you I think of two of them we showed you the drop set and I always do triple drop sets as well triple and it was it's really good like I really do get a really good I felt really really good today like really nice and um, my boy Sean as well you guys need to get on Sean Sean needs to come correct like he comes to the gym with me three days a week, he grass when he's with me, but on the weekends and stuff, the rest of the days when he's busy with work, he be eating a whole lot of bullshit, so Sean, start fucking up, making a team up. But currently, today is what? Today is Monday? Yeah, today's Monday, so we started, that's no, not, today's Tuesday. I think I filmed the last video when I was eating pizza on, I think on a Friday, on last Friday, so it's been a few days, I'm not even gonna lie, after they had the pizza, the very next day, I had another takeaway. And I'm probably thinking, DJ, why did you do it? And the answer is, because I wanted to. In, in this video you saw today, my weight as I woke up was 158.2 So I need to get myself back down, I did say I wanted to get to 150 didn't I, so Right, zoom out that face Anyway people, right now I'm about to do a voice up Well, I should have already done the voice over, you should have seen it over You should have heard it over the footage, I think I probably came in and out Because you'll see me wearing this top um, basically, what I'm going to show on screen right now is the mic that I bought and basically that, what that is is that it's going to attach to my clothing which means when I'm working out I can sync it to my phone and probably talk to you during the workouts. Obviously for future voiceovers that is the reason why I bought that mic. It's So basically I can talk to you guys while I'm in the gym, do like instructional type videos here and there, whether I do it in the vlogs or not. So hopefully you should up like the the quality because I can do more informational videos to you guys without having to try and depend on someone else or if the gym is really really quiet or ambient sounds so stay tuned for that but anyway hope you like this video so far like comment subscribe I think after this I may show some clips from like a few days ago when I was with my friends also before I go I just gotta know what's Flash saying the TV show because my little brother said it's good and my older sister knows nothing about Marvel says it's good but basically I'm, look I'm still looking for extra shows to watch and I'm contemplating watching Flash if it's good please let me know below in the comments because I think that might be the next one I'm gonna watch Flash I'm not sure about Arrow but Flash is I've heard good things so I want to hear what you guys say because you're my peoples. How do I get all the nasty ones? You just don't like it. <laughs> Take one more. I don't like you no more. I don't know if I feels upset. I'm gonna have some tea later. <laughs> you said that so heartfelt, like, like, the, like they had empathy for you. Yeah. Here goes. This was her idea, you know. <laughs> yeah, he probably thought it was easy, that's why. Are we going to do the noodle one for the hotter? Yeah, we can. New needles times two, and it's like, dude, way hotter, like, hot sauce. But anyways, they game games. He's got so many 